idea de aventura es uh, crear un ambiente donde podamos llevar a la gente al extremo y ellos pueden tomar decisiones, decisiones profundas, relevantes a su manera de vivir. hemos creado un mundo tan fácil, tan sencillo, que simplemente con aplastar un botón se puede manejar un montón de cosas en nuestras vidas, o por lo menos así lo creemos. Nuestra vida es tan compleja internamente y es una vida tan profunda que no se puede apagar o prender con un botón. Hemos llegado a un punto donde la aventura es una necesidad a veces simplemente para acordarnos que tenemos que vivir. It is really cool to see a person that shows up and says, you know, I, I just came here to have fun, uh, and they didn't come with a mentality of being challenged. And uh, within 10 minutes, 15 minutes, you see him uh, being challenged. It goes from there to realizing that they can learn something more. Uh, something more about the body of Christ, something more about their calling, something more about what God wants from them. La aventura le empuja a esas personas a dar ese siguiente paso, ese, ese paso que Dios les está llamando a dar. Tomar esa decisión que va a afectar sus vidas, que va a afectar sus vidas personales, su vida profesional. Queremos ver que esas personas sean retados y desafiados a dar ese siguiente paso. Our desire is to see people transformed at an authentic level, not just to change their behavior, but to become new people. Oftentimes that kind of transformation takes going through something difficult or something hard. We create a safe environment in which people can go through something hard, whether that's physically, emotionally, relationally, and then we guide that experience, we facilitate the processing of that experience so that people can see the truth about who they really are and who God wants them to be. Y creo que por otro lado también responde a la necesidad de muchos jóvenes que pudieron, que tenían el deseo, tienen el deseo de poder salir y experimentar una experiencia en la montaña. Y es muy importante porque mucha gente no tiene los recursos, mucha gente no tiene el equipo, no tiene la guía, ni siquiera sabe cómo hacerlo, pero tienen el deseo. Ecuador es un amazing country. There's so much beauty, there's so much rugged wilderness. And we want to equip leaders to guide their own brothers and sisters into that wilderness to have an encounter with God. Y el hecho de que haya un lugar que es accesible, y un lugar que tiene, la, el, que tiene el, el equipamiento, que tiene el, la experiencia para poder, uh, para poder facilitar este tipo de actividades, eh, es, es muy bueno y responde a la necesidad. We hope that this multiplies. There are very few who are doing something intentional to challenge people at a deeper level. We believe that this is a powerful tool and we desire to put that in the hands of leaders in the church here. The amazing thing is there's a bigger picture here that in the process of doing these retreats and challenging people week after week after week, a group of core leaders is being developed. Long-term results, what I've seen, I think uh, uh, they, they have names and uh, those names are of people that are still following him and not only following him but they are passing on the message of Christ to the next generation. <laughs>